Sag, this is your bonus reading. Thank you so much for voting for your sign as you ranked one of the highest on my channel. In this reading, we're going to ask spirits and angels what to expect in your love and career sector for the rest of this month. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with all of you. Time frame may not be exact as intended in this reading as time is an illusion in tarot, okay? Let's get your reading started, Sag. Okay. Spirits and angels, what should Sagittarius expect and love for the rest of this month? Okay, Saj, so expect a return from somebody from your past. Six of Cups here, okay? It does look like they could be thinking for sorts, thinking about returning. That could be a communication coming in from somebody from your past whom you have already rejected because this could actually be... Hmm, the Nine of Wands can be you or your person, but I feel like this is somebody you are in separation with. Yeah, definitely expect somebody from your past returning to try and fix things with you with the Three of Pentacles here, okay? And the Fool is in reverse. I feel like maybe you are going to be very um, cautious with them. You're not sure. Maybe you're not sure um, when this communication uh, um, arrives. I feel like you are not going to be 100% sure whether you should give this person a chance. Okay. Nine of Pentacles is here and we've got the Temperance. I feel like the whole time that you've been just trying to focus on your independence, focusing on other things, okay, getting your stuff together, focusing on your mental and emotional health, you know, trying to heal from a separation with the Three of Swords here. And we've got the Magician. So it looks like you are going to for the rest of this month, you're going to continue, okay? I feel like manifesting a lot of things, uh, especially when it comes to your finances or your career and for your emotional and, again, um, and your mental health as well, okay? Coming out from a separation. And none of Cups is here. So it looks like a lot of you are going to be very happy, okay? It's like, yeah, heartbroken, but also happy that at the same time, you've got a lot of stuff done. You've got a lot of things done. You've got other things around you, people, or money, or you're just happy being uh, alone without this person, even though you're happy, but then, of course, you're still heartbroken, and you're trying to heal, and you're doing your, the best that you can to, you know, maintain this balance within yourself. And the Ace of Pentacles is in reverse here, Saj. Um, I feel like past person may return to you, okay, um, by the end of this month. But it may look like you are going to reject them because Ace of Pentacles is in reverse. You might end up feeling like, you know what, I think I'm better off without you. <laughs> I think I'm better off and I'm happier. Okay, I may not have the full 10 cups, which is, you know, 10 of cups is happily ever after with somebody else, okay, or within the family uh, unit. But none of cups, as you can see, it's, this person is alone, but alone also, you know, it's nine. Nine cups is almost 10, so that's still a lot. You have a lot of love to give for yourself. I feel like a lot of you are quite contented with being alone and I feel like because of that you kind of don't want to ruin all of the work that you have done on yourself okay and you don't want to ruin that by letting this person return you may be thinking you may be considering because four sorts is here you may end up considering it but I feel like you think this is just way too big of a risk to take because you've already done so much for yourself to heal and you know and and then now this person is going to come in and you fear that maybe it's going to you know destroy everything you worked on for yourself and you're not sure if it's a good idea right so we've got the nine of swords here in reverse yeah such if you've been thinking about 
this person from your past. I feel like you are going to be like if you've been stressing out, what you know, you're not sure what this person thinks about you. If they're gonna return, you're gonna be kind of relieved that whether you're gonna take them back or not, it looks like you're gonna be relieved that at least, you know, that yeah, I think, you know, they do miss me and that they wanna return and they possibly want to apologize as well. So it just kind of, it, it kind of gives you some sort of a sense of relief or closure in some way, shape or form. But the Queen of Cups is right here as such. So this could actually be somebody completely new as well. You may be meeting somebody new, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or this could actually be somebody from your past, okay? I feel like after that, I don't know why, I'm just sensing just this huge, like, relief, you know, when this person returns. Not because you want them, maybe you do, some parts of you, but at the same time, you just don't want to ruin, you know, all the good things that you have already done for yourself yeah all right Saj, let's get you some career career messages spirits and angels um what should sagittarius expect in your career um, for the rest of this month show me more Okay, Saj. So it looks like uh, Five of Wands in reverse and got the Three of Pentacles here. I feel like you're going to be focusing on your work. And maybe for some of you, you might be collaborating with people. Um, or you, I feel like if you have some issues with people in the past, as in you know, arguments or gossips or whatever chaos, okay, in your work environment, um, or you feeling really stressed out, it looks like you're finally going to come to a point where, you know what, I should get this together, I should work, you know, harmoniously with people around me, okay? So, chair is in reverse and the ten of wands, you may be feeling kind of stuck, okay? But it looks like you are reaching your destination. It is hard. It looks like you're going to work, be working really hard and you're going to be feeling really exhausted, okay? Um, and feeling kind of stuck as well. But I feel like um, you know that, you know, you need to do that and that it's in the end, it's going to be worth it, okay? There is some sort of a delay. For some of you, you could be trying to, you know, make sure that if there have been some, how do you say, um, sorry, I'm distracted because the prayers, I'm not sure if you guys can hear the prayers, <laughs> but if you feel like something is not moving forward, you're feeling kind of stuck, um, eventually, um, I wouldn't say at the end of this month, but maybe it will bring towards the, now it's um, March, maybe April or May, okay? It may take a little bit longer, but you get there, okay? If you need to heal something from your, your past job, uh, for, heal something from your job, your career or your business, like you need to fix something or you need to make things work, I feel like slowly you will see the results, but um, it will take a little bit longer, uh, maybe April, May, June, all right? So it's not going to be that quickly, but it will happen, all right? Sagittarius, this is your reading. I hope you liked it. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe currently. I am accepting personal reading requests. My information is in the description box below if you'd like to book me. Nothing else. I hope to see you tomorrow as I've been posting videos almost every single day lately. Take care, Sag. Bye.